do anything you want me to do. Maybe another time, maybe another life. You will be my wife and we'll get it right. Hey y'all, it's me and it's that time again. So welcome to my official birthday vlog. This is your girl's golden year. My birthday is currently seven days away. The skin is skinning. My nails, I'm giving everything a break until my birthday. Um, I'm not gonna guys like show you guys like my preparations. I'm probably only gonna show you like probably like me making some alterations or you know accessorizing some of my outfits and then my birthday trip destination which i've already been there before to see what it's like so um yeah so if you guys want to see this birthday vlog just keep watching please remember to like comment and share if you're new please hit that subscribe button if you're a returning subscriber you don't know already Big up yourself every single time. Guys, I'm turning 24. I'm old as fuck. Been less than a few days. But here we are. I'm definitely, definitely an adult. There's no going back. So anyone that's younger than me, enjoy your youth. Enjoy your days. I'm still young though. Still young, but I'm getting to I'm very close to that 30 mark right now, okay? So everybody else, who they fire, not touch 28, please enjoy your youth. Do everything you can for as long as you can. Alright. So um I just left the store. I'm going to get like some finishing stuff. Some finishing stuff for like my dress and my outfits. So I found like this perfect little sticker patchwork thing that I saw at Obby Lobby because you guys know like most of my outfits, I add like extra gems or mm, why this curtain? I work against me. I like extra gems or anything like, so you know, give it a little bit more. So they look different because I like when my outfits look unique and they don't look like something someone else has worn. And even if it looks like something someone else has worn, something is still different about it. I add my flavor to my outfits. I add my own flavor and style to my outfits. So, um, I'm gonna put some little finishing touches on my birthday outfits like my actual the day of like those two outfits those are what i need to put some finishing touch on so i'm gonna put on screen the patchwork that i saw um they didn't have my first name initial so i used my nickname which majority of my friends and family or friends that i family call me everybody else call me angel but but just call me Tavia. Yeah, Tavi. So, yeah. Um, I'm gonna be using T instead of A because they didn't have any A, and that kind of worked better for that outfit for my birthday outfit. I just don't know if I'm still gonna wear a tie with my birthday outfit. I feel like it's kind of oldie. I think it's oldie. So I might, I might not. We will see. Um, and then my birthday dress, um, some of the trimmings that I saw in the store, they all look like curtain trimmings and I was not going to put it on my dress. So I found someone on Amazon, so I'm going to have to add that to my dress as well. Um, and some other things, but my, my skin is just glowing. I'm so pretty. I give life to the lifeless purr. Um, and then guys okay my birthday wig come and it looked more blonde than a highlight blonde wig so me enough of myself good day the wig um i use a copper like ginger i'm more ginger like a light orange type ginger dye and some brown dye and oh it's more like it's more like 2b it's not black so it's like 2b 2b 4b I remember and i added some color to the wig in most other parts because i'm like it's more blonde than a highlight blonde okay i'm gonna do that now i know the wig too dark so i was saying to my friend like should i bleach the wig 
I ain't trying to read I like it. I'm like, when they, I don't know how they made that wig. More than likely, they had already bleached it to get those whatever eyelights or whatever they did. And then me go dye it. So me feel bleach it. You know, we can only take so much. So I'm not trying to like fuck it up. So I'm thinking I should look here just to leave it alone. And don't touch it. Right hand on the Bible. Um, Cause you know, it looks good. It looks really good. I just still needed like a little bit more lighter highlights in there. I shouldn't have like, cause I dyed some of it darker, but then I still left all like the lighter pieces, but I need more lighter pieces in it. So that's why I wanted to like bleach it again. But then I'm like, it was already bleached. And then we got dyed it. And then chemical that mix up, mix up in that wig is not good. So I'ma just leave it alone. It looks good nonetheless. Um, so yeah. So y'all, I took a little nappy now. Like, I'm gonna try to fuck up. This is my birthday wig. Else I'm gonna screw it up a little bit. Uh, um, so I was like, I'm gonna share a little gem with y'all. As you know, I'll be showing that uni every time. Don't mind me, I look a hot mess. Um, so I've been trying this underarm detox scrub and let me tell you like this works like this especially if like for those people who have like darker armpits like made my aunt use it and it's been working great for her this is literally my second jar i've been using it for like several months now especially for me like the only reason why i have like a underarm scrub dedicated just for like my underarm is because i do laser therapy right and I have to do, I have to exfoliate regardless, I exfoliate my whole body, but like after like a week, I have to like get rid of all that, you know that dead skin, cause you know laser, it burns, so yeah, so I have to like get rid of all of that, and I made sure I got like a scrub dedicated just like my underarms, just like how I have a scrub like from my pubic area, I have one just for my underarm, so this it's mixed with charcoal and coconut and basically it's like it works it really works so as a female you know we always have to invest in our body so yeah this is the thing if you're someone who already knows about underarm scrubs and know that they work really well but this is one and this is a really good one the coconut and charcoal it's a really good one especially if you have like darker armpits this will help like this and like a turmeric underarm scrub will work yeah so this works perfectly for me so the dolly i'm gonna take a shower wash the hair um and try it look like someone's style. I'm going out of town for my birthday. Sorry, what's taking so long? You like my gel braids? Her. I'm doing my hair on Friday. Oh, I got my toes done, by the way, today. Oh, you guys can't see. Never mind. So, I'm here opening this. I think that one is from DeAndre, but I don't want to open it. Oh my god! I don't want to open that one yet, though. Oh my god! Oh my god! I wanted these, oh my God, so bad. So bad. <laughs> I can wear this on my birthday, oh my God. Bro, bro. Okay, I'm on, I'm on. <laughs> Okay, okay, I'm gonna calm down, I'm gonna calm down. Just a little bit, I'm gonna open the one for the enjoy it. I'm not open it, I'm gonna have to see if something to like. Oh my god, bro! <laughs> Period! <laughs> bro, listen! This is how I should be rocking for my birthday, honestly. Because this, you know, I always look good with like. Aw, oh, shit! 
fuck. Okay, guys. I wanted to do a gift unboxing of the gifts that I've gotten thus far. And I think I'm just going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to call that in and I'm going to do it. So this is one. Well, this is the second package I've opened. Um, this is the one from Deandra. I don't want to open the one yet, though, from Deandra. I want to wait until my birthday. Deandra is my best friend, if you guys don't know, which you guys should know. She's been on my channel like so many times, but bro, this glasses is stopped here. I have no idea who sent this one, though. But I know I, I have an idea. I think I have an idea. Oh my God! Period. I can wait until my birthday. open this one i'm doing another gift unboxing i don't know which day of the vlog this is but it's not my birthday yet today is the 17th <laughs> my birthday is not until next week tuesday but i've received some of my gifts already and i'm like why not still have to get a few more gifts from everybody else but the only one that i think i'm not gonna open today as i said i think this is from deandra but this is quick though. This is so quick. I don't want to open this yet. Let me not open this yet. I think this is from Deandra, as I said, and I'm not opening this yet. I'm going to wait until I probably get back from my birthday trip. I open this, you know? So I'm probably not going to do all of my gifts in this video. So any ones that I didn't do, or well, in this part of the video, any ones that I didn't do, I'm going to save until like the end. Or probably I'm going to do my gift unboxing at the end of the video. I don't know. But alright, this one now mm -mm. this definitely now mm -mm. this definitely now mm -mm. so that's that, that so I already looked at my glasses my Valencia glasses like her alright so that's that one I'm already I was like I'm gonna take this with me on my birthday trip but then I kinda changed my mind because one of the black outfits is black and um black and silver and then guys i got myself a mew mew glass um sunglass because you know where i work they do sell high-end designer so and it was double it's going out like fuck why not i saw a brown pair too that i want and a green pair it's only gonna be like i think 300 or something like that or 200 i don't want 150 that's a bit for me this thing so just a 300 but my is gonna be like 100 or something but anyways so we're gonna go in what we have here and see what I got because these are also gifts that I received like in boxes I just put them in gift bags I didn't open like I made somebody do that for me because I did not want to see what's in there oh my freaking god this is the scarf I have been wanting the beauty scarf um her her I don't know if somebody's still in your gift bags <laughs> God. Oh my god, I'm so excited. This is not even funny. I'm gonna be my baby. Valencia I got in here too. Like, bro, I'm so excited. Okay, Bath and Body Works. We know it's not much to do this stuff, but Bath Body Works. Okay. What is this? I can't go obviously. Um, oh, this one's so good. Running out of candles, like, and then I have strawberry pound cake body wash. Okay, more body wash, shampoo, into it. Perfect. I love me some champagne toast. Okay, so that is another gift. Oh, Louis, 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 blood seed. What's what? Father God, good child. Period. 
and your work is in this. You feel like it's something this is just heavy. You know what we see that this just seems so heavy. Like I thought my own love. I mean I got bad. Let me see what next. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Yes, bitch. Perfect. Good morning, y'all. Welcome to my birthday week. It's officially Sunday, period. So your girl is getting ready to go on her flight. Nails are done, lashes are done, hair is done, Her. So I'm getting ready to go on my flight. Um, I'm wearing pants. Um, let's take a food bar room. I'm wearing pants. I'm gonna put my jacket on. Yeah, pretty hair, fresh face. Nothing too much. Make sure I have money for that. You already know that I have flawless and pretty skin, so that's that. Um, I literally have nine minutes to finish getting ready, but I'm like, let me just get this part of the vlog started. Like, bro, we are officially at my birthday week, and old age, finally, a catch up to me. Literally, old age is finally catching up to me. And I think they're right on the corner no more. They're just literally right there. Right there. So I'm finna accessorize. I'm gonna put my new babies in. And put my washes on. With my watch on and my bracelets on. And head out. Because I need to be on time. On time. On time. Your girl is not going for late today. Um, bro, all my tripods are packed in my bag. Literally, my personal bag is literally looking like a carry-on bag. And I'm low wondering if I should change that. And the only reason I'm using that bag is because I'm bringing my, as I said, I'm bringing majority of my tripods. And a particular, my standing tripod, like my tallest tripod, like literally with one of my tallest tripods, like it can't fit in any of my bags even when I fold it down so that's why I had to bring it in that bag so now I'm wondering like bro should I put it try to put the stuff in my smaller bag because I don't want them to tell me any food issues at the airport I certainly don't want them to tell me any food issues at the airport but honestly as I said it can't fit in anything else so I'm gonna have to leave it how it is and the last thing as I want to do is have a check bag because I don't want to go to baggage claim my life is at the worst place to go at a freaking airport, bro. You have to like literally wait forever on your bags. And I'm not trying to do that. I'm not trying to do that. I hate doing that. I only try to do, I only have like a suitcase like when I'm going to Jamaica. That's it. I got checked back because I'm not doing it. Get somebody else to do it. I don't even know if you guys can see me for funny times. Y'all are like all the way down there. All the way down there. But, um. Okay. Oh, God. And I already gave mommy all her birthday presents because I won't be here. And she gave me mine. Uh, as I said, like, in the other unboxing that I did, like, some of them are really not gonna open them until I get back. So like, mommy's presents. Well, I will open one of them, unfortunately. So, um, in there. I have to wait till we come back. I'll show you guys what are in those. I'll show you guys what else I got, if I do feel like it. But yeah. So, do you like my new bracelets? They're so cute, right? Okay, so I have a sweet up, sweet up. Smell amazing, you know? Smell really amazing. And head out!
So guys, I'm here at my gate topping your porch. You know, I had to get these dresses done because your girl cannot do the far walking thing with her back problems. Yes, yes, yes. But, um, anywho, um, my flight's going to be boarding shortly. Thank God. So, that's good. Ah, but I am tired. I want to sleep. I really want to sleep because I'm dying to get on this flight. So, I can go take a nap. The face is giving me tea, face is tea, of course. Do I have a view? No, the fuck I don't. I just have a view of the road. And this is the bathroom. So y'all, we finna get some food, some good good Jamaican art, I think food and go get see some movies. <laughs> sure. Thank you, thank you. Let, leave me in here. Leave me in here. Leave me in here, man. Yeah, oh well. Wicked. Ooh, I came back and the tree still has lemons. Have lemons. It was that. Yes, it was that Sunday. Mm -hmm. 
And I know it's on a holiday, so I don't get it. Cars are coming. Look at me. I'm not raw. Not even a little. You are. You surely are. Thank you. They know luck. Stuffing our faces of many things. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> and I'm being influenced to go and freaking watch a horror movie. I don't do horror movies, people. We all know this. I'm afraid of those things. And now I'm going to have to watch a whole fucking horror movie. Wait, I'm never let go. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So we're gonna go watch Never Let Go. Don't mind me here. Me here is all over the place right now. So we're gonna watch Never Let Go. And I'm gonna just tell you guys how it goes. Cause honestly, I'm gonna watch it over here. First see everything. Let's see, we can't sleep tonight. First year. We can't sleep tonight, are you me have you? Anyway, can you bring the popcorn, please? Thank you, honey. You need butter? Wally. <laughs> you know that should be dry. Yeah, actually, you need Wally. So, too much butter. Whoa. There's one layer. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Because I think she's still using that one. I'm good. I'm done. Oh, I hope you never let go. Yes. How about that? It look, it look. Your fault, antique. I slimy. Which one said that yours? I'm gonna need so much slime for mine. Can I just look so wrong? <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Come on, was it theater two? Yeah, theater two. I remembered. So I tore off the weird on the one kind of somewhere. I get my vice ready to scream. <laughs> oh, the, the, that, oh, you know, some mystery. <laughs> I'm like, fucking disgusting. Anywho, but I have a dog. When he would do stuff in the house, we had to, so. Yeah. That's my mom. So, how was the movie? Yes. Yes. I'm not because. And then when look up and scream, my mother asked me. What happened? What happened? Don't ask me that, man. The freak. I'm not supposed to be watching horror films, but it wasn't that scary though. But that snake thingy, something, and I don't like snakes, so I think it's gonna be burnt in my brain. And snakes are, you know, evil. Shut up. Snakes are literally demonic. Anyways, um, it was it wasn't that bad. Like I thought it was gonna be, cause every time little horrific sounds come on, you know, like there's gonna be like a very dreadful scene. It wasn't that dreadful. You can't say it's watch it. <laughs> watch it. I watched it. I watched most of it. I just only didn't see two scenes. The one with the little girl and another one. That was it. I just, I just didn't see two. But everything else I did see. 
that that's good enough because normally I wouldn't see shit so give my props to that I did good I did great guys I watched a scary movie yay never happen again though you would never get me doing that again never never so now we're heading back to the hotel to go chill because somebody has things they need to do apparently No, look at me. No, look at me. No, look at me. And I'm exhausted. And I need to get ready for it tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be a long, long day. A very long day. Mm -hmm. 